hey, welcome back. It has been a while. Um, I've just been really, really busy recently, so I haven't been making a lot of content, but we're back and I'm uh, in my office for at least the next week before I jump on another plane and head out to another conference. Um, so I wanted to check in. You know, since uh, being gone, I've taken, I finally got around to taking my uh, Geox Security Operations Management Cert, uh, and I wanted to do a review about that because I love that certification. It is fantastic. So the GSOM is based on SANS MGT551, which I think they're currently in the, the, the middle of renaming maybe to like a leadership path versus a management path. But anyway, um, and the course is really targeted at people looking to run security operations teams or security operations centers and things like that. Um, and I found it to be a really refreshing balance of modern management methodology uh, combined with good, you know, fundamental technical stuff that you probably need to know if you're going to run this off. Um, the outline, it's a five day course, like the history of this class is it started as like a two or three day course. I took it a few years ago when it was a two day course, I think. Um, last year, sometime I participated in like the question waiting exercise and stuff like that. So we could go through and help kind of de de determine which questions made sense for the roles that we're all in. And then I got locked out of taking the test for a year because of that. So, uh, when February of this year came around or March or whenever it was, uh, I was finally eligible to take the exam. I jumped on the opportunity. Uh, I got to review a lot of the material that had been expanded since I took the class um, and then take the exam. And obviously I passed. Um, so now I have my GSOM certification. It came in the mail actually a couple of days ago and it's going to go right up there in that little hole uh, sitting above my head um, as soon as I get some more frames in. But uh, the cert itself is really, really good. Uh, it covers a wide array of stuff ranging from basic SOC design and operational planning. So things like how many people do you need? Who should even have a SOC? Should you work with an MSSP? Um, how do you, you know, estimate alarm capacity and things like that? Uh, it talks about uh, general telemetry and analysis. So the, the methodology behind collecting data, how should you do collection? Where should you get collection from? Uh, it touches on really lightly on things like incident response, threat hunting, attack detection, and then really dives into a lot about which metrics make sense for managing a SOC or an operations team uh, and the continuous improvement cycle and things like that. Uh, so all stuff that I very, very, very much like. Uh, John Hubbard and Mark Orlando were the uh, authors and instructors for the course. Fantastic work by both of them. Um, really can't recommend this cert highly enough. It's probably my favorite GEOC that I have currently. Um, it was a 75 question test, two hours, multiple choice uh, from a test format. It didn't have any of the labs or any of that stuff that some of the more uh, technical exams are starting to have. Um, but it covers a really nice array of, of information. And there are tons of solid references in the book, in the books themselves. So even as you're reading through the, uh, the, the, the material for the course, if you were to take it, uh, they reference a lot of really good books outside of it, good articles, good white papers that really hit home as far as I'm concerned for building and developing socks. So if you see that in your kind of future, if you're looking at getting into managing sock teams or security teams, or you're looking to build a sock maybe in your, in your business, this is a top notch certification to kind of dive into. Um, so yeah, there's my review of the, uh, of MGT 551 and the GEOC uh, Security Operations Management or Manager Certification. Um, highly recommended. Anyway, we're back. Uh, I'll have a bunch more stuff getting posted over the next couple of weeks. Uh, have a great one, everybody.